Hey YTPC, tonight mixing up some haunted pirate ship. Basically, taking some pirate cake and some haunted bookshop and I mixed it one for one like that. And I went ahead and loaded it up. This is my first pipe. I don't remember the name of it, but I'll put it up on the screen. Uh, it's got a bottom is actually plastic and kind of like the what do they call it? Falcon pipes. This bowl comes out. It's supposed to collect all the moisture in the bottom. So sometimes it works good, sometimes it doesn't. So we'll get a char light going and see what we get. I already can tell I'm going to like it. Now, I love the pirate cake anyway. The haunted bookshop was just kind of, uh, was kind of okay for me. But it's already tasting much better, the mix. Okay, the char light's done. I'm gonna let it sit for a minute and I'll be back. Again, the char light, I did get the, the preak from the pirate cake and on the retro hail, I got some, some citrus, um, I'm guessing from the haunted bookshop. I don't know if it's the burly or the Virginia's in there, but let's do a true light now. Yeah, tangy citrusy is definitely first place so far. It's kind of overpowering the a lot of Kia now. But we'll see how it goes. Wow, really citrusy. <laughs> and the Perique's just, just in the background there. So we'll see how it progresses down the bowl. If, um, my, so far, I would probably up the amount of pirate cake that I put in just because it seems like the, the haunted bookshop is winning over the pirate cake a little bit. So maybe I need to adjust the way I measure it out. Okay, now it's starting to change, but I'll come back when I'm about halfway down and 
let you know what I'm thinking. Okay, I'm about halfway down now, and it's constantly changing. It's it's going between the the Latakia and then back to the Citra. So it it's a very interesting smoke. It doesn't stay the same for long. So my initial thought of me having to add more power cake, I don't I don't think so. So it's a good smoke and there's enough preek to keep me uh to keep me happy. It'll disappear for a little bit and I'll get the the tangy citrus and then it'll come back in uh strong again. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm happy with it so far. So I'm going to go from half down to the bottom third of the bowl, and I'll come back and give my final thoughts on it. Okay, I'm down to the probably the last third of the bowl now. And this one has gotten better the further down the bowl you go. And in, in the beginning, it started off with, I mean, even on the retro hail, it was pretty much all uh, tangy citrus flavors. Now I don't, could have just been the randomness in the way I picked it or mixed it up. But as it went down, started to pick up with the Latakia a little bit. And the Turkish from the pirate cake and and at the bottom third, it's it's a blend of everything. It just tastes tastes great. So for me, the ha bottom half to bottom third, that's the best part of the smoke so far for me. Definitely going to make. I'm going to use all the rest of my haunted bookshop to make this haunted pirate ship because I have extra pirate cake. So, because I much prefer the haunted pirate ship to the haunted bookshop. This mix, I, I don't know. I think they said it was matches, uh, custom idea to mix those two together, but I give it definite two thumbs up. So even if you're not a fan of one or the other, you probably like this, unless you don't like Latakia or uh, the heavier Englishes, then maybe stay away. But if you like Pirate Cake and you thought Haunted Bookshop was maybe a little so-so, mix up some Haunted Pirate Ship. That's what I'm going to do. All right. I'm going to really enjoy the rest of this bowl. I'll catch you all in the next one.